Welcome back, everybody, and that now I'm mad here. So, um, uh, Star Wars Celebration was last week, and they announced a few projects, a few new movies that maybe will, maybe won't come to fruition. You never know what Star Wars these days. They announce a movie, then they don't. They, they announce a movie, and then they drop it. What is that Boba Fett movie? We never got that. Where's that, uh, movie for, uh, Patty Jenkins? We never got that. Where's that Kevin Feige movie? We never got that. Where's that Taika Waititi movie? We never got that. They give it, it and then they hang it away. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, when we found out that James Mangold is going to be directing a Star Wars movie 25,000 years in the past, like in the beginning of the Force, the birth of the Force, I like James Mangold, he's a great director. I go back all the way to like Walt the Line, Cop Plan, 310 to Yuma, um, The Wolverine, Logan, Ford v Ferrari. Um, he's gonna have that new Indiana Jones movie out this summer. Night and day, you know, with me, without me. With me, without me. Hey, we might see Tom Cruise in Star Wars. Or maybe Hugh Jackman, you never know. Um, he's a really good director. I really like a lot of his work. Like I think you go back to Walt the Lion, 310 to Yuma, uh, Logan, 4V Ferrari. I mean, the guy knows how to direct. And even like his romantic comedy, Kate and Leopold. Not a bad little movie. Or his little horror thriller, Identity, with Amanda Peet. I think John Cusack is in that. Not a bad little movie. Um, so he's going to be directing a new Star Wars movie. Cool. But also we found out that same day that, you know, a couple, about a month or two ago when James then announced his lineup for the new DCU, he mentioned a Swamp Thing movie. And it was officially announced too that a couple of days later that James Mangold will be officially directing the Swamp Thing movie. Now, I don't know when he's going to be doing both of these movies. Because he's about to start shooting the Bob Dylan movie with Timothy Chalamet starring as Bob Dylan. And I can't wait for that. Like I said, the guy who did Walk the Line is now doing a Bob Dylan biofilm. Can't wait. So, these might be way, way in the future. I mean, maybe he's got to do the Bob Dylan movie now. And then, get on to... And who knows, he might be doing Small Thing first, or he might be doing Star Wars first. We don't know. But let me know in the comments below, are you having that James Mangold is directing the new Star Wars movie and the Small Thing movie? Would you, would you have rather had somebody else direct the Small Thing movie? Let me know in the comments below, Matt, I'm back here.